Simu is a popular Wii U emulator that is available on a number of different platforms. Most people with a Steam Deck are likely using EmuDeck to install this emulator, but I'm reading that a lot of people are unsure of where to put the keys.txt file. So today, I can show you where to store that file once you have downloaded it from the internet. Now, I am unable to show you how or where to download the keys.txt file, but most of you will be able to find it quite easily using just about any search engine out there. As mentioned, we're working with a Simu install that is done using EmuDeck. If you're unclear on how to install this popular Steam Deck mod, then you're in luck. I have previously created a video showing you all of the steps involved to install EmuDeck, so I'll be sure to include a link to that guide in the video description below, and it will also be included within the pinned comment as well, so that it's easy for everyone to find. If you have EmuDeck already, but still are unable to get Simu installed, then let me know in the comment section below as I may need to create a dedicated video about that. Once you have Simu installed and it is working though, let's get to putting that keys.txt file in the correct folder. So you will need to put that keys.txt file on the Steam Deck. This can be done via the micro SD card slot. You could have the file already in a USB thumb drive, or you could have it available on a network drive, which is what I do. Just use whichever method is easiest for you and make sure that you have that file readily available. Then we're going to reboot the Steam Deck into desktop mode. And once you are here, let's go ahead and open a file manager window. Dolphin is going to be installed by default. We're then going to click on the home location from this pinned section for places up here. And we're going to need to show hidden files and folders. So click on the hamburger menu icon right there. Find the show hidden files option. Click it. And once you have that option selected, you'll see that there is a check mark next to it. So again, while we are in the home directory, we're going to double click on local, and then we're going to dive into the share folder. So we're gonna double click on that. Here, you should see a folder labeled Simu, since this is going to be created after Simu has been installed with EmuDeck. So we're gonna double click on that, and it's this folder that you're going to paste or transfer that keys.txt file into. Just remember, this file needs to be labeled keys.txt. So if you downloaded a zipped copy, then make sure that it has been extracted when you put it here. And one thing to make note of, if you installed EmuDeck to a micro SD slot, then you're going to want to do all of that through that micro SD slot. So you're going to click on home, then you're gonna to go to deck, then local, then share, then Simu. And again, put that keys.txt file there so that your Simu install can locate it. Now, once you have that file in the proper location, you can go ahead and return back to gaming mode to test things out. Once you're in gaming mode, just load up Simu like you normally would and make sure that it detects your games properly. So if you ran into any issues during this process or if you have any questions about the Steam Deck in general, then you can use the comment section below to ask. And please remember to like this video 
while also subscribing to the channel for more Steam Deck tips like this.